It's been proven by a gazillion of YouTube videos, mine included, that this giant crane is awesome. It gets even more awesome when a new firmware update comes out. Now upgrading the firmware wasn't exactly easy thing for me to do, so I'm making this video to help out. Specifically I'm talking about upgrading to 1.60 version, but I'm pretty sure that the process is gonna be the same when a new update comes out. With this update, the payload increases to 1.8 kilograms. This is Crane V2. I haven't done the upgrade with any other version of the gimbal. I know that Crane 2 is coming out soon, but again, I can imagine that the process is gonna be the same, as long as the same software is gonna be used. And as always, before you start, make sure that the batteries are charged. Okay, so let's get to it. First thing to do is to open up Giant Tech website. And let's go to download section. That's where you get the software you need for the upgrade. Click on that and scroll down to software download. Now I'm on Windows, so I will click on this link. They actually call it calibration upgrade tool. Well, they call it that because you can do two things with it. You can calibrate and upgrade, but we'll be doing the upgrading only. So click on that and I'll save it to a folder that I already created on my hard drive and save. Okay, let's scroll down to data download section. This is a list of all the products they have, but we are talking about Crane. So you will click on the firmware button there. So you click that and I'll save it to the same folder. Okay, well, let's go to the folder we saved it to and I'm going to extract all the files from the folders. Just extract all. And the firmware extract all. And here it is. So let's open the software we just downloaded. Let's make it a little bit bigger. Okay, I know it really doesn't look very friendly. Now it's time to connect the crane. I'll just use the USB cable that I got with it. Make sure you plug it into USB port, which is near the joystick, not the other one. And the other end just goes to any USB port on your computer. So the program recognized the gimbal and the empty field changed to COM3. Now you click open right next to it and then you go to firmware upgrade. Click browse and find the folder where you got it saved. And open. And now it's all ready for the actual upgrade. All there is left to do is to press the upgrade button at the bottom. Now I already done the upgrade so I'm not gonna do it again but all you need to do is press the upgrade button and that's all done. So I hope this was useful and if it was then maybe press the like button or even subscribe and I'll see you in the next video.